everybody, what's happened? It's Sarah Bunny, and today I'm just going to show you Rosie's grooming kit. So, grooming kits are really important to have on hand, some for emergencies and stuff, and also you obviously need to clip your rabbit's nails about once every two weeks, depending on how much they grow and what you put in their cage to make them not grow. But about every two weeks is my general rule. And um, also, you need to brush. It depends on what fur coat your rabbit has, but I personally have to brush Rosie almost probably three times a week, probably more actually. So that's it, just depends though. So I'll just show you what I have in my grooming kit. So the first thing, the first brush is a one of these, and it's basically a slicker brush, but I got it for Walmart for like two dollars, so it was cheaper. Um, it's got sort of hard bristles, but they're plastic. And then it has a white part on top to trap the hair in. So this brush didn't work as good as I thought it worked. It probably worked better on short-haired rabbits. You'd have to see, though. So the next brush I have is this, which is just a wire bristle brush. Which works pretty good on Rosie, actually. It's probably the best brush I have for her, or one of the best. And it's really hard, though, so I just have to really gently brush her, but it works very well. Next, I just have this flea comb. As you can see, Rosie started chewing on it one time. Um, she got out of her cage a long, 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 long time ago. Got into it, but... Um, it's just a flea comb, and Rosie knows she doesn't have fleas, but I just think it's easier to brush with this. It's it's a better hair removal way, like a way to remove hair, I guess. And lastly, we just have this soft bristle brush. These are just good if you want, is like a last minute touch up thing. Um, they remove some fur, but they're really just to make it look good. <laughs> So next I have these, which are nail clippers obviously, and they're dog nail clippers. So they just have a little thing that goes like this. I'm pretty sure that's a file, I'm not, I'm not really sure what that is, it's just kind of on there. So you just, it's not fixing, alright, you just clip it down and that's what they look like. And I find these a lot easier to use than like rabbit nail clippers because, um, oh, this thing helps you see where the quick is, where you're cutting, I mean. Um, I find these a lot easier to use than rabbit nail clippers because one, they have a way better grip, and two, they're a lot sharper so it gets it done quicker. <laughs> but you just have to be a little more careful with these because you can't see as well. But they are way better to grip, they're like holding scissors almost. So the next thing I have, which goes along with the nail clippers, is this, and it's a bag of flour. I haven't been able to find any styptic powder besides BinkyBunny.com, um, so if I do find some, I will buy that, but um, if I can't find some in like a month or so, I'll, um, I'll go to Binky Bunny and buy some, but none of the pet stores by me have it for some reason. So what I can just do right now is I read online that if you don't have stick dick powder, a quick way to stop bleeding would be flour. So I'll just use this because it works in kind of the same way and it is cheaper and I just had it on hand. So I just put that in a Ziploc bag. The next things I have are also things from home. So these are just Q-tips and this kind of cotton swab that are like flat. Um... And these are just good because, like, once a month about, you have to clean out your rabbit's anal area, like, because it gets, like, wax builds up, and it's horribly disgusting. So you can't just, like, yeah, but you just use these and put a little water in a Dixie cup and just, it's horrible. <laughs> but you have to do it or get your vet to do it or something. A lot of people don't know that. In fact, I didn't know it till like two months after I got Rosie, so I had to, I found it on Binky Bunny, and I started doing it, and it's just awful. Then these are about for the same reason, but I'd more likely use the Q-tips because they're just easier to use. 
So these are just cotton balls. So that's really all I have, um, except when I am going with her, I do use this, oh, sorry, this towel, um, just because I do bunny burritos for clipping her nails. She hates, um, actually it's less stressful and it's easier for me, so, yeah, if you don't know what a bunny burrito is, it's just, you wrap them up in the towel, and then you're able to pull their, like, not pull their, like, I, I pull their legs, like, partly out of the towel so you can clear the nail and just clip it right away, and it's a lot less stressful for them, so, yeah. So, that's basically all the grooming supplies I have, just over here. And thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And keep hopping. Bye.